Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for December 23rd of 2021. Well, it is titled three planets and a comet. So what do we see here? Well, here we see a nice image of the night sky. And very close to the horizon, we do see a comet and that is Comet Leonard, which was a visitor to the uh, inner solar system and something that was able to actually be seen with the naked eye uh, just a few weeks ago. Now you can see it there. It's that fuzzy patch right up above the horizon. And above that we see a line of three bright objects and those are three of the planets in our solar system. Over to the right hand side the brightest of these would be Venus and over to the upper left we see the planet Jupiter two of the brighter objects in the night sky. And we also see in between those two hiding in between the clouds there is the planet Saturn. Saturn a little bit fainter than the others. It's further away twice as far away as Jupiter and also smaller. So it does not look near as bright. But we notice that they follow a straight line and in fact follow along the line we call the ecliptic. That is the apparent path of the sun through the sky and the sun, the moon and the planets all follow around these uh, the same plane. And that is because the solar system is relatively flat and the sun, the moon, earth, planets all, all follow in roughly the same plane that you could actually draw them on a piece of paper and make that a relatively good approximation to what the solar system looks like. However, things like comets are a little different and we notice that here that the comet is way offline from the planets. Comets can have very inclined orbits and can come in at steep angles to the rest of the major objects of the solar system such as the planets. So they can be seen at large distances from the ecliptic. Uh, the ecliptic also passes through the 12 constellations of the zodiac and that's why they are important constellations because they are the ones that the sun moon and planets pass through. So they will pass through those 12 constellations whereas a comet could pass through any constellation because they can come from all different angles. And here we see Comet Leonard there just at the edge of the just above the horizon as it slowly begins to disappear and will of course is going to be moving into the southern sky so will no longer be visible to observers in the north but will be heading into the south and will getting fainter and fainter so we'll still now need a binoculars or a telescope to be able to see it. So that was our picture of the day uh, for December 23rd of 2021. It was titled Three Planets and a Comet. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.